Hey guys, this is Nala with Bear Knit Made Leather Goods and All-American Bulldogs. I got some collars made and I wanted to share them with you. I got a few of them made, but um, I'll share them with you guys. These are three-ply collars. These are actually thicker than the four-ply collars that uh, I was getting from um, another distributor, another seller that went out of business, so I had to start making my own collars. But I have... The same quality leather that I use for my leather goods, the same quality leather that I use for my belts that are guaranteed to last a lifetime. This is 10 to 12 ounce Wicked and Craig English Bridal. This is 8 to 10 ounce Wicked and Craig English Bridal. And I just finished this collar. This one's for my boy, man. This one I just kind of put it together for my boy Minion. But, I mean, this thing is a beast. So, measurement, right? These measurements are not going to be very accurate simply because if you know how belts are measured they're measured from the belt buckle the tip of the belt buckle to the holes right now the thing that is different about these collars is these collars are the exact same size as the collar that i have on minion now if he's over here chilling so I can come over here and bother him. If you see that collar that's on him right now, these collars are the same length as that collar. Okay, but the sizing's different. And the reason being is because this is thicker when it goes around his neck, it is um, shorter because this is thicker. So going around his neck there is less room on the inside than there would be on that collar because that collar is thinner so with this one oh look how thick that is man i didn't measure it man but this is a thick thick collar that thing is going to be able to withstand whatever but this is for minion um i can make you a collar this thick but for what you know what i mean um the leather collars that I was getting from uh, that company were probably more on the this width. You know what I mean? So this is straight up overkill right here. I mean, this is cool and all. I could make you one, but it's going to cost you an arm and a leg to be this thick. This is very expensive leather, guys. This is expensive leather. I can make these in one ply and you should be good. I can make this in a one ply collar and you should be great. Um, so hit me up if you want one. I can make one ply of either of these leathers. I can do it for 25. If you want one like this, it'd have to be 50, uh, but I can do it. But simply, that's just a lot of leather, man. That is overkill. I just did this for my dog uh, because my dog is a beast and he's going to wear a beast collar. If you want your dog to wear a beast collar, then hit me up. But either way, these are going to be some really nice collars. I'm going to make some of these. These are going to be considered my mediums. I'm going to make some that are going to be this length that are going to be considered large. Minion's uh, neck is 21 and a half. So it took a lot of this because it's so thick to wrap it around. It took a lot uh, of leather. So just hit me up if you want one. This is what I got and uh, I'll be knocking them out all week. All right. So if you need one, these nylon collars are 18. 25 for one ply and 50 for two ply. Thanks guys. Remember it's good high quality stainless steel hardware. So you won't have to worry about the elements. Thanks guys.